Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Welcome to Purpose and Marital Bliss with Pastor Honoring. Today I have an urgent prophetic word for someone. God says there is about to be a shaking, but he says the assurance is you are not going to sink with it. God says there's about to be a shaking, but he says fear not, you will not sink. This word is coming from the book of Hebrews chapter 12 and verse 27. I read from the Message Bible. It says, the phrase, one last shaking, means a thorough house, cre house cleaning, getting rid of all the historical and religious junk so that the unshakable essentials stand clear and uncluttered. I take that again. The phrase, one last shaking, means a thorough house cleaning, getting rid of all the historical and, relig and religious junk so that the unshakable essentials stand clear and uncluttered. God says there is about to be a shaking. Someone, you just started your walk with God or you have been walking with God for some time. God says there is about to be a shaking. This shaking is not meant to kill you. Everything in your life that doesn't have eternal value is about to be shaken. Wrong relationships are, are about to go. But distractions to your walk with God are about to be taken away. Issues with your character, issues with your, you are about to be pruned. God says, but fear not, you are not going to die. Because when he starts doing this, you are going to feel like all hell is breaking loose and you don't know what to do. And you are going to start asking what is wrong with you. Are you under attack? The devil is after you. God says, fear not. First assurance is you are not going to sink with the shaking. But you are going to come out better, stronger than ever before. God says you are going to come out with core values. You are going to, he's going to take, get rid of, of, of the bad relationships that you've had this far. People who have been a negative influence for, to your life. For some reason, they are going to start leaving you know that this is a sign that God has started doing what he promised. Know that that is a sign. But when they start leaving you, God is bringing you other people into your life. He's bringing destiny helpers. People who will help you be a better Christian. Connecting you to people who will help you fulfill purpose. Connecting you to people who will help you better in your work with Christ. And then he is making you better. Every negative attitude that you've had. Everything that you felt like was a weakness, God is starting to deal with it one after the other, one after the other, one after the other. And the, the problem with weaknesses is that they become a comfort zone. You become comfortable with them. But when they start dealing with it, that's when you feel uncomfortable. When prayerlessness is your weakness, when God starts prompting you and compelling you to get up and pray at night, of course, you are, it's going to tamper with your sleep. So you are going to feel uncomfortable, but God says it's for a good cause. A better you is coming out with core values that have eternal worth. So you are not going to sink with the shaking, but you are coming out taller, stronger, and better than ever. I hope this word blessed you. Shalom.